Here, friends, we're gonna draw a cute little puppy. Yeah, we're gonna draw a Westie. Yeah. <laughs> we hope you guys have a marker or something to draw with and you're gonna follow along with us. This is gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be super cute. You ready to start? Yeah. You also need a pink colored pencil and we're gonna move that off to the side. Do you know what the real name is for a Westie? Mm -hmm. West Highland White Terrier. That's a long name. Yeah. That's why we're gonna call it Westie. Okay. <laughs> first we're gonna draw our dog's little nose. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna draw a V first. So a little V on the left side of our paper. It's so tiny. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> we're gonna draw right here. Little V. Little V. <laughs> then we're gonna connect the top. And that's gonna be our nose. Our little Westie's so nose. Cute. <laughs> and we could color that in. Let's okay. color it in. Next, we're going to draw her eyes, and they're going to be little ovals. We're going to draw a little oval, like that. Okay, right here. Yeah, that's a good spot. Little oval. And then we'll draw a smaller oval inside, and then color in everything except for the little oval. Okay. Now we're going to draw her other eye over here, and we want it to be the same size. Okay. <laughs> Then we're gonna draw a small one inside, and we'll color in the big one. Now we got our eyes, and I like leaving little white spots because that makes it look like her eyes are shiny. Mm -hmm. Now let's draw her mouth. We're gonna draw an upside down V right under her nose. She <laughs> looks like, like she's frowning, huh? Mm -hmm. We're gonna make it so that she's smiling. Okay. So go ahead, do the V first, upside down V, an A shape. Then we're gonna draw that the corners of her mouth, and this is going to make her look like she's smiling. Okay. So a little up, and then another up on this side. Isn't that, that, yeah, now she looks like she's smiling. Now let's put her tongue right here. It's sticking out of her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> a U shape, and then we're going to draw a line right down the middle for the middle of her tongue. <laughs> Wesley's look like they have little beards or mustaches. <laughs> so let's draw another V underneath her tongue. Okay. And we're gonna draw some zigzag lines to give her her little beard. So we're gonna draw little lines on each side. So it looks like an M. Then let's draw this side first. We're gonna draw the beard on this side and then we'll draw her beard on this side. <laughs> so let's draw a little line over Yep, and then let's draw an A shape. Yes, and then we're gonna draw another one, but this one's gonna come up higher. See how it's coming up? Mm-hmm. Good, and then we're gonna draw another, like a sideways V, an A, good. And then we're gonna draw this line that curves over and it's gonna kind of make her cheek. See how it's making her cheek? Good, yeah, now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So a little line over. Good, and then the little A shape. Then we're gonna draw that next line, but this one's coming up more, just like it did on this side. And then a little A shape again, another one. And then we're gonna draw that curve over for her cheek. <laughs> we did it! That's her little beard. <laughs> now they have little hair that goes over their eyes, and it looks like eyebrows. So let's draw a little a shape that's going off to the side, just over her eye. Right here? Yeah, that's a good spot. Then we're gonna draw another one that goes over, okay. over her eye. And then this one's gonna just curve down. Yes! Now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side, a little curved A shape. Then this one's gonna curve down even further. And then a little curve. So let's come back in. Right here, let's come in. Yes. And then we're gonna come back out and then curve down like that. We got her eyebrows. It's mm -hmm. starting to look like her, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's draw the top of her head and we're gonna draw her ears too. So right here, we're gonna draw, put a little point in between her eyes, 
above her eyes, but in between them, okay? And from there, we're gonna draw a little curve, come out, and we can draw that on both sides. Let's do it on both sides. Okay. Yes, and one on the other side. Then we're gonna do a little zigzag back and then curve out more. <laughs> then we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Little zigzag back and then curve down. Perfect. Now, we're gonna add her ears on top of this, and they're just gonna be little ears, but they're gonna be pointy and sticking up. So let's draw an A shape, little A. Let's draw a little A on this side too. Okay, now we're gonna draw a bigger A outside of that one. And a bigger A on this one. Now we got her ears. <laughs> now she just has a little more fur on her cheeks and we're done with her head. Okay. So let's draw a little zigzag, two little, or three little zigzags right here. So three little A shapes. Good, and we'll do the same over here. Three little A shapes. So that's her short fur right next to her ear. And then we're gonna do a big V coming down and back up. Good. And then back up. Back up right there. Yep. Good. Now we're going to come back down. And this one, let's bring this one down a little further, maybe down to there. Okay. And then we'll curve in to her cheek. Perfect. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. V-shape. And we're gonna curve it down. And then connect it into her cheek. <laughs> Good job, Hads. She looks really cute. Give me five. Did you have fun? Yes. Okay, should we finish her? Mm -hmm. Let's draw her collar next. And we're gonna draw a big U-shape that comes underneath her chin for her collar. So start. Let's start right here and then come over to right there. Good. And then let's draw her tag, little circle right under her collar. Now let's draw the fur on her chest. So let's curve out, little curve from right there and kind of curve out and then zigzag back up. Then curve again down, back up. One more, curve, and then back up. Good. <laughs> now let's draw her first leg and foot. We're gonna start right here, come down. That's her first foot and leg. Then we're gonna draw her foot and it's gonna curve. We're drawing a cartoon version. Mm -hmm. So we're just gonna draw a little L shape. Now we're gonna come back and we'll finish her fur, but let's draw her other foot. So another, another line coming down. We can draw over here, coming down right to there. And then that L shape. And then we're gonna draw a little zigzag going into her leg. Perfect. I like it. She's going to have little legs. <laughs> now let's draw her back. We're going to draw a little line. Comes out. <laughs> so we'll start right here. Draw a little line. Comes right to there. Good. And then let's draw her tail. It's going to come up. <laughs> Do you like her tail? It's sticking straight up. <laughs> What's wrong with her tail? Okay, so draw draw the tail right here, and we're going to go all the way up to there. <laughs> what is wrong? You got the giggles. 
There you go. You did it. We got through the giggles. Okay, now let's come back down. We're going to draw the other side of the tail. So it's going to come down. And so we'll draw a little line that comes down halfway. And then we're going to draw some zigzags. Okay, so we'll go up, down. So a little zigzag up and then back down. Oh, I like it. And then another one up and then down and into her body. Down and then. Into her body. Good. Okay, now we're going to draw her back leg, but we want to make sure that we don't make it longer than her front legs. So let's put a point down here that's right in line with her front legs. So yes, right there. That's a good spot. And then we're going to draw a curve that comes down. <laughs> comes down halfway to that point. Yes. Then we're going to do more zigzags. So she looks furry. She looks like she has fur. Good. And then another zigzag. And then one last one. And then we're going to curve into that point. <laughs> okay, so on yours, instead of having this curve like that, let's draw a line that goes all the way up to this point. So curves this way. Okay. Yeah, there we go. That's okay that we have a little extra line in there because that looks like fur on her mm -hmm. body. Mm -hmm. Should we keep going? Yeah. Okay. Remember what's the most important thing? To have fun. Yes, to have fun. <laughs> okay, let's draw her leg. So we're going to draw her back, well, her back foot. So let's draw the same distance that we drew on the front. Okay. Good. And then we're going to draw a little up for her foot. Okay, now let's draw a little up for her front leg. And then in between here, we're going to do zigzags for her fur. And you can just make it messy. I'm going to just do this. And you can draw her fur doing whatever you want. Okay. So you can draw a zigzag to connect the front leg to the back leg. Perfect. <laughs> now let's draw her other back leg. So we're going to draw another line comes down. Right here? Yeah, that's a good spot down and then over for that L shape and then back up. There's her other leg. We did it. <laughs> you did awesome. Now we can put our markers off to the side. We can put the cap back on them and we can get our colors. We, I said we were just going to use pink, but let's also use a yellow and also a gray. And we're going to do pink on her tongue. Okay. So Drop pink, color in her tongue pink. And we'll do the inside of her ears pink. Then we also colored her collar pink. <laughs> and you don't have to. You could color it blue or orange. You don't have to use the same color. Now, let's use... Oh, you're still going. Now let's use our yellow. And we'll do a gold tag. Because she's a princess. Now let's use our gray. And we're going to do some shading. So right here on her back leg, her back front leg, we're going to do a little dark. See how I started dark? Close to her chest. And then as we get down to the bottom, get lighter and lighter and fade out. Does that look like a cool shadow? Yeah. Wow, you're doing a great job, Hads. That's perfect. <laughs> now we're going to do the same thing on her back leg. Okay. Okay, let's shade a little part on her cheek, just right here behind her little beard. <laughs> and we'll do it on this side too. So just start really dark right in the corner and then get light. We did it, Hads. You did a great job on shading your little Westie. And I did one last thing. I went back around the outside of my little puppy with a darker line. And I didn't want to make it too dark, but it makes it look like it's popping right off of the page. <laughs> and if you want to, you can, but you can leave it just like this. Give me five. Did you have fun? Yes. You promise? Yes. How old are you? Um, seven. Seven. You can be extremely proud of your little drawing hats. Mm -hmm. We hope you guys had a lot of fun drawing your Westie with us. Remember, if we went too fast, you can always... Pause the video. Yes, you can always pause, pause the... the video. <laughs> and it's okay if your drawings don't look exactly like ours, because the most important thing is... To have fun. Yes, to have fun. <laughs> we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> oh, are you a little Westie? Oh, don't lick me. <laughs>
Ha, 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 ha.